Stefanos Tsitsipas versus Riley Opelka is the first semi-final for the Canadian Open for 2021. And both players have been impressive to get to the semi-final stage. Opelka entered the tournament unseeded and will take on the wild card Nick Kyrgios in the first round. And after dropping the first set, he would rally to win three, four, six, seven, six, six, four. His second round opponent would be the number 14 seed Dimitrov, with Opelka getting through in straight sets in a very impressive performance. 6-3, 6-4. His third round opponent would be against the inform Lloyd Harris. And after dropping the first set, again, had to rally from behind, winning it in three tight sets. 4-6, 7-6, 7-6. His quarterfinal opponent would be the number 10 seed, Roberto Batista Ragu. And after a close second set, Opelka got to the semifinals. 6-3, 7-6. The final City Pass entered the tournament as the new world number three and the number three seed and would get a bye in the first round. His second round opponent was against his Olympic conqueror, Hugo Humbert. And after a very tight second set with one of the most intense tie breaks of 2021, Sidney Pass prevailed in three, 6-3, 6-7, 6-1. His third round opponent would be the silver medalist at the Olympics, Karine Hashinov. And Sidney Pass would dispatch of the Russian pretty easily in straight sets, 6-3, 6-2. His quarterfinal opponent would be the number six seed and inform clay court player, Kasper Rudd. And even though their second set was close, Rudd's game could not translate onto the hard court against someone like Pass, who got through in straight sets, 6-1, 6-4. These two have only played the one time before. That was last year in Cincinnati and it was a first set retirement for Opelka. Pass getting the win, but it's not a true win because they didn't finish the match. If Opelka's gonna win this one, the serve. It has to be working. And the ground strokes as well. He's played against big players during this tournament. Of course, beating Kyrgios in the first round. Very interested to see if he can do that against City Pass because City Pass has been very, very good in this tournament so far. If City Pass is going to win, he's going to have to return well off that big serve of Opelka. And he's also going to have to serve well himself. If he lets Opelka get any break points, we've seen over this tournament, Opelka can break serves of big servers and big opponents. So he's going to have to serve well himself, Steph, if he is going to get the win over Opelka. This is a very interesting match for me because both players, we haven't seen them actually play each other in a full match. Of course, they played Cincinnati last year, but they didn't finish that match off. They didn't even finish the first set. But I'm going to go with Sidney Pass to win this one. He's played well at this tournament in the past. He actually made the final here a couple of years ago on a dream run, really a breakout run when he beat Djokovic along the way. So I'm going to go with Sidney Pass to win this one in straight sets. I think it's going to be a couple of tie breaks though, as Opelka always loves to play the tie breaks. But let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this one?